Ban Si Che is Vietnamese street food. Hello to everyone who wants to listen to McDonald's podcast about food enjoyment before the Easter holiday. Today, the sun's rays are before the Easter holiday, so I'm thinking about skewers or grilling. Then I think Ban Cha is Vietnamese food in Vietnam. Around lunchtime, the streets of Hanoi smell of grilled pork and delicious, sweet and sour sauce. Then it's ban cha. Why not cook the summer's coolest barbecue at Easter time? Ban cha is a typical Hanoi dish. It is also world famous and the most famous Vietnamese dish after the excellent breakfast soup pho, which has become a real trend dish here in Europe. The Vietnamese are good at barbecue, and this dish consists of grilled pork, two ways, noodles, and a vinegary sour dip. Barbecue, ban cha for lunch. If you are in Hanoi, you can smell when it is ban cha. This is classic street food, and the pork is grilled over small fires. You eat it for lunch, and only for lunch. After 1500 hours p.m., the service is over, and the delicious smell of barbecue disappears from the streets. Grill ribs all year round. The dish is made with pork in two ways, and thin ribs are usually used. You can also use frozen barbecue ribs, which you can find in the freezer. Half of the rib is cut into thin slices and grilled while the rest is ground and formed into small meatballs. These are also grilled on a grill grate, where the buns are sandwiched between. When the meat is ready, they should be put into a sweet and sour sauce, made from fish sauce, vinegar, chili, lime and sugar. Without this wonderful combination, the dish would not be the same. The sweet and sour sauce is perfect against the fatty rib meat. But don't forget the herbs. They are absolutely essential in Vietnamese cuisine. It is usually coriander and bean sprouts that apply. Mint can be used if you wish. Barbecue in the park. As this is real street food, we recommend that you eat this with your fingers. If you are going to take this food to the park, you can put noodles, meat and herbs in lettuce leaves, preferably Romano lettuce. Finish the sauce and put the herbs and salad leaves in their own boxes. You can cook the noodles in advance. Grill the meat on a small portable grill. In fact, the small grills are perfect for bancha. The meat comes close to the coals and gives exactly the delicious grill taste that both the meat slices and the meatballs should have. We hear a big hooray for ban cha, the summer's coolest barbecue at Easter time. Try something new on the grill and make trendy, Vietnamese barbecue food ban cha. You need this for four people. One kilogram barbecue ribs without bones, and swear, or more than that. Marinade. 1 half dl fish sauce 5 spring onions, thinly sliced 3 garlic cloves, finely chopped 1 tablespoon soy sauce 1 teaspoon ground black pepper Sweet and sour sauce 2 tablespoons fish sauce 5 tablespoons of rice vinegar 3 teaspoons of sugar 1 dl water 1 red chili, sliced. 2 garlic cloves, finely chopped. 1 tablespoon lime juice. 1 packet of vermicelli rice noodles. 1 packet of bean sprouts, or sugar snap peas. 1 pot coriander. 1 half pot of mint. This is what you do. Step 1. Cut the pork ribs in half. Grind one into a fine dough. You can do this by hand, in a food processor, or in a meat grinder. If you use barbecue ribs, remove the rough edge and grind half of the meat. Step 2. Form small size balls, 
with ping pong balls. Press the meatballs so that they look like a hockey puck. Stack tree. Make the marinade and put the meatballs and the rest of the meat slices in the marinade in the fridge for two hours. Step four. Make the sauce. Make sure the sugar dissolves in the vinegar. Step five. Cook noodles. Step six. Wash lettuce and herbs. Step seven. Take the meat out of the marinade. Grill the pork slices. The meatballs are grilled in a double grill. You can buy one like this in most grocery stores of a certain size. Step 8. Then dip the meat in the sauce before putting it in a plate with noodles, sugar peas, and herbs. For more detailed information on how to make Asian cakes or European cakes, please leave your information and click the subscribe button below to receive free consultation support. Thank you for listening and following this McDonald's podcast. I jump, you will hear from the next videos. With best regards. McDonald's podcast. March 29, 2023.